Good. Welcome. Thank you. Good, good, good. Okay, just dropping down inside yourself, into your heart, into your breath. Just for a moment before we open our world culture. Ah, that's good. And now we'll bring our hands together in front of our chest into prayer position. Then bring it up into our work coach on this eighth chakra. Eighth energy field, this golden orb, this golden globe. And then we'll just spread that all around us. Opening this sacred space all around us there now. And underneath. That's good. Now we'll bring our hands together again. Open up over the class, those that are here now, those watching the recording in the future, and then spreading this out, out over us all there now. Enjoying this peacefulness, this serenity, this quietness. This letting go. That's good. Relaxed. Melting away. Now we'll just take our fire stick, our death arrow, and we'll blow any of those negative thoughts, feelings, emotions we have into the stick and we'll put them to the fire. If you don't have one, you can use the intention of blowing into here as well. just putting it to the fire to release all those thoughts and feelings and emotions. Thank you for the lessons learned. That's good. And if you have crystals, pick them up to use them. The one on the left hand with the terminal end pointing in, and the one on the right hand, the terminal pointing out. 
or any other crystals you're holding on to. Allow that energy to come in and through and then in negative, negative energy heading out. And just close your eyes, just relaxing, just melting away. Hmm. Being mindful, being aware of your breathing. Feeling that sensation of your breath coming in out of your nose or your mouth. Being aware of the feeling as your stomach expands and contracts when you're breathing, with your breath. Feeling that energy of the crystals coming in and through your body. Any of those inside or outside noises or sounds that you hear allowing you to go into deeper levels of relaxation. Relax. Letting go. Now allow and bring that relaxation down your body from the top of your head down into your forehead, forehead into your eyes, and your nose, cheeks, down to your chin. Those muscles in and around your jaw just Relaxing, letting go. Allow that relaxation to come down the back of your head, down to your neck. From your neck now down into your shoulders and just, shoulders just letting go. Shoulders down your arms to your elbows, to your wrists, to your hands at the ends of your fingers. We're going to allow that relaxation down the front of your body, your chest down into your abdomen, back of your body, upper back, middle back, lower back, relaxed. Down your thighs to your knees, front of your thighs, back of your thighs, letting go. Down to your ankles, muscles of the calves relaxing. Down to your feet, tops of your feet, underneath, relaxed. Now this relaxation as you're relaxed more into this meditation, this mindfulness. Aware of your breathing, do breathing for the counts of two. Breathing in for two, hold for two, out for two, hold for two. I'll introduce the drum as well, just help with concentration, allow the vibration to work in and through your body. Starting now, breathing in. One, two, hold. One, out, hold. In, hold.
once more. Now for the count of four, in. Out. You're breathing back to your normal breathing rhythm. And as you're relaxing there, I'd like you to picture, visualize, imagine this light coming out from the top of your head. This light, any color of the rainbow. Special light. This light is full of peace, love, light, healing, and protection. Bringing this light out from the top of your head, going all around your body like a cocoon of peace, love, light, of healing and protection. Now we're going to share this, spread this out. Take this out now and around the room or the space that you're in like sound waves spreading from its source, sharing this peace, this love, light, healing and protection. Now taking it around the building, spreading it out further now around your neighborhood, Sharing this peace, this light, this love, this healing and protection. Special light coming out from you, your color, your color of the rainbow. Now from your neighborhood, taking it around your village or your town or city. And now around your nation, your country, sharing this peace, love, light, healing and protection. Now taking it around neighboring nations, fully around Pachamama, around Mother Earth, around Gaia, this peace, love, 
light, healing and protection from you on the top of your head, sharing it all there now. Now like you said, to send extra light, extra energy to the areas of conflict, areas of conflict that we're hearing about, to the other areas of conflict we're not being told about. Now to areas closer to home, maybe conflict within friends and family, loved ones, work. Extra energy there now from you, from the top of your head, sharing this peace, love, light, healing, and protection. And now from around Pachamama, around Mother Earth, around Gaia, I want you to send it out into the universe, out as far as you can, this light from your head, out into the universe, this peace, love, light, healing, and protection. Now bringing your awareness back into the room, back into your body, back into your breath, back in now, being mindful of your contact with the floor, with the cushion, with the seat, with the bed, being aware that you've been held, being held by gravity this force that is holding us, it's looking after us. That's good. Relaxing, aware of your breath aware of your breathing, aware of everything that's going on around you. <sighs> aware of who and where and what you are. <sighs> aware of your energy in your body, this warmth, this inner healing as you're allowing and doing for yourself and enjoying this luxury of abandoning time. Luxury of abandoning time as you're meditating. <sighs> Letting go. Peace. Relaxed. And as you're relaxing there now, working with a Guide and meditation of becoming motivated. Motivated for you and your life. Everything that you're doing for yourself now. As we can all set aside time each day to increase your motivation. Face your fears and experience your true worthiness. You. In fact, are truly priceless. All that you need to do is relax, breathe, and follow your inner guide. Utilizing daily motivation techniques instill within you simple methods of awareness that benefit every aspect of your life. Daily mindfulness practices can be done at any time of the day. It's highly encouraged that you do not skip a day in order to fully experience the great changes that you are making to your life by doing so. Skipping days of meditation could result in losing all progress you have made. 
Breathing is the most important thing that we do. It is keeping us alive. Yet most of us do not notice our breath all day, and some for even several days. That's why it is so crucial to our physical and mental health to oxygenate our bodies fully and consciously. So let's take five deep and full breaths together and holding it for five seconds at the top. One, inhale fully positive energy. And when you exhale, just let go of your breath, taking you into a state of relaxation. Two, inhaling goodness and exhale into relaxation. Three, inhale acceptance and exhale any judgment. Four, inhale health and clarity and exhale into serenity. And five, fully inhaling desire and achievement and exhale into complete relaxation, breathing normally and letting go of all concerns from daily life. Good. This is your new solution to facing your fears. Whenever fear presents itself, you simply take five full and deep breaths, holding at the top of the inhalation for five seconds. And when you exhale, you blow out any fears that you feel. When you take your last breath, imagine you are breathing in courage and strength while letting go of your last breath. Say to yourself, I am relaxed. For some of us, worthiness does not come easily. Sometimes it's hard to even imagine feeling deserving, yet worthy is a state in which we are born and most of us just simply need to be reminded. You are born invaluable, priceless and praiseworthy. So let's remember that feeling now and just allow yourself to feel worthy during this approach. Imagine that you're a, a tiny bubble and there are people surrounding you that love you. They wrap you in blankets to keep you warm and care for you when you cry. Just imagine how you feel as a baby, worthy of this care and love you are being given. Good. This tiny baby deserves to be cared for. This tiny baby feels good in their spirit and body when their worth shines out and is appreciated. Now imagine that you are now holding this tiny baby. Notice how they feel small but powerful in your arms. You feel dignified because you are in the presence of pure worthiness. And that in turn makes you feel worthy too. Honoured to share the love between you and this baby. As you hold this pure goodness, honour this moment. Cherish this feeling. God. Now hear yourself saying, it is natural for me to feel worthy and to honour the worthiness of others. Each day in every way I feel better and better. Better than you, better than brand new. In order to make change and motivate myself, I challenge myself. 
change is not always comfortable. In fact, it can be inconvenient. So if I feel comfortable with the changes I am making, I'm probably not extending myself enough. When I have a fearful thought, I acknowledge that I feel this way and then I completely release it. And when another fearful thought arises, I catch it quickly and I say with confidence, I acknowledge that part of me feels this way, but this thought does not help me right now. It is just a thought after all. Each day in every way I feel motivated and strong. Whenever I am presented with feelings of being undeserving, I know my breath is there to soothe me, guide me into relaxation, releasing this unnatural thought. Every single day, I become more aware of all the good things going on in my community and in the world around me. When I feel unwanted emotion holding me back, I know that the way to break through this is to take several deep breaths, relaxing my mind and body by doing so. This way I can clearly see things for how they truly are. Good. Each day, in every way, I face fears. I now challenge them with courage. In order to make great change, I control my thoughts effectively. From now on, I challenge every single negative or unproductive thought that arises. My intentions are pure. Nice. From this point forward, whenever you find yourself having a negative and unproductive thought such as, I am unmotivated, you will immediately say to yourself the word, enough. Let me repeat this so that it is perfectly clear to you. Any time you find yourself having a fearful, negative or unproductive thought, you will immediately Say to yourself the word, enough. And the very moment you say the word, enough, you will find that these negative thoughts you are having will simply disappear. This gives you the opportunity to start a new positive thought process. Good. When you're ready to begin building a new positive thought process, begin this technique of awareness. Just become aware of your body now and notice a gentle wave of relaxation is sweeping over you. Feel how your body feels when you pay attention and really feel this wave of relaxation that you deserve to feel. This makes you even more relaxed, calm, and clear. You are a crucial factor in the forces of love. You are indispensable. You are a valuable energy radiating worthiness. You are the key to unleashing fearlessness. You are irreplaceable. You're extremely useful, extremely helpful, and fully motivated. Your courage is of the utmost importance. People notice you and you compliment them honestly and you are appreciated. Good. You're doing very powerful work by practicing this meditation daily 
without skipping a day. This is the way you change your life for the better. For the better now and forever. And forever is for a long time. Forever is for a long time. Bringing your awareness back into your body. Feel the breath moving in and out of your nose or your mouth. That sensation. Your abdomen expanding and contracting. Aware, mindful of your contact with where you're sitting, lying. Knowing that you're held. Held by gravity. Held by spirit. By God, by the universe. Take a moment now to think of all the things that you're grateful for in your life. This time of gratitude. Taking a few moments to set your intention. Intention for meditating. Intention for the day ahead, the weekend ahead, the month, years ahead. Intention for yourself. working with the crystals in and around you. Believing in who and what you are as a unique, special individual. There's no one else on the planet exactly like you and never will be another person exactly like you right now or in the future. When they made you, they threw the mold away, period. You're born into this world with the same rights to succeed as anybody else, same ability to have and believe in who and what you really are. For now, for you and forever. And forever is for a long time. Forever is for a long, long time. relaxed, allowing the self-healing to be a part of who and what you are. This luxury of abandoning time as you meditate. Those of you who are wanting to carry on meditating, just turn the volume down and carry on. If not those, in a moment will count from one to five, and I reach the count of number five and not before. Or you allow yourself to come back to full awareness if you're feeling calm, rested, if you're feeling refreshed, full of energy, one. Slowly, calmly, easily, gently return to your full awareness once again. Two, every 
muscle and nerve and fibre in your body be feeling loose and limp and relaxed, be feeling wonderfully good. Three, from head to toe, be feeling perfect in every way, physically perfect, mentally perfect, emotionally calm and serene. Four, your eyes will feel sparkling clear as if bathed in a cool spring mountain stream. On the next number now, in your own time, you'll be fully aware, feeling calm, rested, refreshed, relaxed, feeling wonderfully good. Number five, up. Slowly open your eyes. Take a deep breath. Fill up your lungs. Stretch. Ah, and smile. Mm. And if you're lying there, or as you're sitting, we'll close there, we're coaches. Bring up the fold like a blanket from around the class and bring it up. Bring it up into your eighth shark with this golden orb, this golden globe of light. And then bring down only what is for your highest good down through your body. And then give some extra to Pachamama for Mother Earth for her much needed healing. Then wrap up the folds of your own world culture. Bring them up, up into this eighth chakra, this eighth energy field. And again, only what is for your highest good, bring it down into your energy centers, your chakras. And again, a little bit extra for Pachamama. Ah, well done. Thank you. Namaste. Aho. And those watching the recording, see you soon.